What's up, you guys? Jamie, the movie maker here. Today, yes, we got a we got a Nerf gun over here. That I'm gonna this today. We're not really doing as much as a Nerf review. Today, we're pretty much just doing like combinational. So I got the uh, Nerf Sharp Fire right here. You've seen me um, use this in a lot of my videos. Breach system, come on. But you see me using a lot of my videos because it's very cool and looks like a realistic pistol. And today for this video, I'm going to be explaining it with the other two pieces that I said it would come with. Ever since I did that video about the, uh, about the fire strike, the jolt, and the sharp fire, which I have right here. Sharp fire has become my favorite now because it looks very, very good with the pieces. But this is how it looks like in complete storage, right here, with even extra bullet hole. All right, but before we get started, I would like it if you could leave a like, share, subscribe, click on the notification bell to be notified about my latest videos, doing about Nerf guns, and much more. So first we'll do the blaster itself, and then we can make all these amazing combinations. So this is how it came in store storage with these other two pieces we'll put that on later but it's a breach system yeah i know but it shoots very well that you already heard except sometimes this goes a little bit down so you're gonna have to do this to it again it's kind of annoying but that's fine um and as well it's also got this now with the other pieces it's got this back stock that could hold extra bullets i only like putting extra bullets up here because down here it just kind of falls out super easily and you put it in this right here then you got a back stock and then you got the front barrel attachment and it looks like a silencer then you're ready to go for like rabid fire it's very cool it's like a rifle type of thing Hard, it's a pretty amazing, pretty awesome gun. And yeah, it's one of my favorites. Oh, and even like today, I'm pretty much going to be going outside with the gun itself, the pistol that you've seen only in that form like this. That this, and one great thing about the stock attachment, it's not, it doesn't just hold bullets. It's also got this thing where you get to like put it on your belt or pants or something so let me go put it on my pants real quick if i could even get it there all right and with the silencer i could put like this now i'm ready to go i look like a big guy and then you could just during nerf war or something i could just take these off Put it right here and then I'm ready to go. And storage, it's very, very easy to do. One thing, one, see, one way you can do it is just take the stock off and put it in this piece, this button through this button right here in the front, the handle of the blaster. And then it'll clip onto the front. And then another, it'll clip onto the front. I'm just going to, it'll clip onto the front. And then one place where you could put the silencer is right here in this hole right here. See, it looks pretty, pretty cool, doesn't it? And it could still shoot. And it could still shoot that way, obviously. It could, it could still shoot that way, so. Almost made the camera fell. So tell me in the comments below whether you like this fire strike or not. It is one of my favorites. I like acting like a cop with it. I said freeze! Uh, yeah, um, this is a great one, except I don't know what category it came on. Probably from N Strike Elite, probably. Doesn't say, just, just calls it a Nerf Fire, Sharp, Sharp Fire. It's all I see. But, yeah, but it's still a pretty awesome gun and i love it looking like this because it kind of also looks like sun from back to the 
from like uh, Star Wars or something. Yeah, uh, I am a fan of this blaster. You know, it's a breach system. And as you know, I would give it a uh, 6 or 7.5 out of 10, okay? Yeah. Oh, hey, oh, oh. And leave a like, share, subscribe. Thanks for watching. And write in the comments below if you really... If you like this blaster, or even if you have this one, or at least are familiar with the other pieces. It also comes in a blue version, which I don't have yet. Well, I don't really need the blue version, because I got the original version. That's good enough for me. But you could get this version and the blue version. I don't know if the blue version has the front attack, has the attachments, but just the normal pistol gun form. But it's still pretty cool. And see y'all next time. Bye-bye.